LaptopKey.com, your source for replacement keyboard keys. Notice, many times, laptop manufacturers produce keyboards that look the same on the outside, but have different retainer clips underneath the keys. To help you find the correct repair video for your keyboard, we've created a searchable database. Simply go to LaptopKey.com, enter your laptop brand and model number, scroll down to the bottom of the page and click on View Videos. A list of all compatible videos will appear. Select the retainer clip model that matches your keyboard. That's all, you're now ready to repair your laptop keyboard. For this keyboard, we will be showing the removal and reattachment of the J key for standard size keys, shift for the wide keys, and mute for the top row of small keys. To remove your standard size keys, insert a tool into the right side of the key at the top right corner, apply gentle upward pressure to separate from the clips, and you're removed. To remove the retention clips, support the bottom of the clip with your finger, insert a tool under the upper right corner and apply gentle upward pressure again and the clip is removed. To reassemble your clips, we'll begin with the top clip which has a smaller end towards the bottom and two openings at the top. For the bottom clip, there's a outward facing notch and two holes at the top. Simply click the two halves together, making sure the support arms and top clip Enter the openings in the bottom clip. Then, using metal hooks here, 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 and here, we will place the clip down bottom first, lay down flat, press on the corners. We will then take our key cap, place on top, firm press, and we're fixed. To remove the wide keys, insert your tool under the right side towards the top edge again. Apply gentle upper pressure, move down towards the bottom, then run your tool along the outer edge of the key to separate from the metal support arms. Then, one more pull upward to separate from the clips. To remove the metal support arms, simply insert underneath and lift Push one end to the side, repeat the other side, and we will repeat with the remaining arm. To remove the retainer clips, support the bottom of the clip with your finger, and insert a tool under the upper right corner, and push underneath, and then inward and up, and then repeat for the opposite side, and lift, and push away to remove the clip. To reassemble your clips, we'll begin with the top clip, which has a rounded edge at the top. And for the bottom clip, there is a notch facing outward on the top edge as well. Then using metal hooks here, 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 and here, we will lay the clip down bottom first, supporting and then pressing the top two corners to reconnect. Then using holes here, here, here and here, we will replace the metal support arms using the top set of holes for the top arm, laying down flat, repeating with the bottom set of holes for the bottom arm, lay down flat. We'll then take our key cap, place on top of everything, press around the edges, center, just make sure to get it all, and we are functional. To remove your top row keys, insert a tool under the right edge, apply gentle upward pressure to the upper right corner, and the key cap will remove. To remove the retainer clips, support the top of the clip with your finger, insert a tool under the bottom right and left corners, lift up, and the clip is removed. To reassemble your clips, we'll begin with the top clip, which has a slight incline on the lower part of the support arms in the middle. And then for the bottom clip, there are two small holes in an upward facing notch on the bottom edge. Connect the two halves together, making sure everything is snapped into place. Then using metal hooks here, 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 and here, 
we will place the clip down bottom first, making sure it's hooked on at the bottom. Lay down flat, with the press at the corners, replace the keycap, and we're functional. We'll now show you how to remove a laptop key. Simply pull on the edge of the key in a gentle but firm motion. Lift up and remove the key. It's that simple. If your key is loose and not sticking properly to your keyboard, your retainer clips are likely broken. This issue can be fixed by replacing your retainer clips. Replacement laptop keys and retainer clips can be purchased at LaptopKey.com. LaptopKey.com, your source for replacement keyboard keys.